Now I'm going to explain to you about two important terms that people are getting confused with these days. Isolation and quarantine. You need to understand that isolation is different from quarantine. Isolation is done to a person when that person tests positive for an infection. And we need to prevent that person from passing on the infection to others. Isolation for COVID-19 is done for a period of 10 days. The reason why isolation for COVID-19 is done for a period of 10 days is that it has been found that symptoms of COVID-19 usually last for an average of 5 to 6 days, but maximally not beyond 10 days. It is during the symptomatic period that the person with COVID-19 can pass on the infection to others. Now, quarantine. Quarantine is done to a person who has not tested positive for infection, but has only been exposed to someone with an infection. And we need to prevent that person who has been exposed from passing on the infection to others. So if a person who has not tested for pass positive for infection and has only been exposed, why do we need to worry about that person spreading the infection to others? That's because when you get exposed to someone with an infection, you could have potentially caught the infection and it could take up to 14 days for you to start exhibiting the symptoms because 14 days is an incubation period for COVID-19.